Good evening. Today I'll be showing you how to make ramen noodles with a delicate meat such as Jack's Lynx Original Beef Jerky. First of all, you will need Jack's Lynx Original Beef Jerky and a classic Maruchan beef flavored ramen noodles. It will go well with Jack's Lynx Original Beef Jerky and a slice of all American cheese. Absolute goodness, if you ask me. Let's get started. First, you'll have to take a piece or a couple of pieces of Jack's original beef jerky and slice it with a knife. Now, be careful because knives are sometimes sharp and you may injure yourself. Okay? So, if the knife is not sharp enough, you will have to use alternative methods. Mine, of course, would be using my hands to break the beef jerky apart but before we do that let's open up the ramen noodles properly i will open up the ramen noodles and place the block of ramen noodles within the rapid ramen noodle cooker check the description part of the page for more information about the rapid ramen cooker next i will open up the seasoning packet and pour the seasoning on top of the block of ramen noodles. Next, I will take the beef jerky, tear it apart because my knife wasn't sharp enough, and place it along the sides of the block of ramen noodles, and add water all the way up to the line. After you add the water to the line, place the ramen noodles inside of the microwave for three minutes. After about three minutes, Pull the bowl, the rapid ramen noodle cooker, out of the microwave and place it on the countertop. Now be careful because the countertop could be cold and the ramen noodle bowl can be hot. Okay? Now place it on the countertop and just look at the texture of the ramen noodles with the beef jerky. And then take a piece of all American cheese and place the cheese on top of the ramen noodles after you've placed the cheese on the ramen noodles place it back in the microwave oven for an additional 30 seconds and after 30 seconds it should be done now pull the ramen noodles from out of the microwave and look at it smell it look at it some more and gently stir the ramen noodles up with the sauce doesn't it look good doesn't it smell good doesn't it feel good taste the chunk of it it's goodness absolute goodness if you ask me absolute goodness